Today we had a dental visit. We just left the dental office, just came out. I'm sitting in the car with Joanne's waiting for Karen to pick up some fabric. So while we were in the waiting room, before Karen was called, we noticed there was some woman with her father in the waiting room. And he's um, he didn't know what was going on. He seemed to be really out of it. He had a one-track mind. He kept saying, after we leave here, I'd like to go to the jewelry store and get a couple of straps for my wristwatch. And she'd say to him, okay, when we leave here, we'll stop at the jewelry store and get those straps. And he'd smile, yeah. Then he was wondering, what time was Mama's appointment? His wife was in with the dentist at the time, and the daughter said her appointment was at 9.30. You know, he looks at his watch, and now it's about 10.45. The, the, de uh, <clears throat> the dentist comes out and tells her, your wife has his, uh, his wife has to have her tooth pulled out. So he, she, uh, she had to sign a release. So she, she's explaining to him, Mama's going to have her tooth pulled pulled out today. He says, when we leave here, I'd like to go to the jewelry store and get two straps for my wristwatch. Okay, when we leave here, we'll get two straps for your wristwatch. Yeah. Yeah, Mama's having her tooth pulled out. He's smiling. He had no idea what was going on. Well, anyway, it was time for my visit. About three weeks ago, I find something on the floor right where I'm working, and it looked like a tooth. I mean, I couldn't tell if that's dental material. It turns out that I did lose part of a tooth, something that was some work that had been done maybe 14 years ago, not since we moved here to Sacramento. So I've got to come back tomorrow for that treatment. Our treatment today was about 500 for the two of us. Tomorrow, just for that little problem, it's going to be about a thousand. So it looks like I won't be making any any money transfers this month. <laughs> no, I understand fully what's happening. No fun. <laughs>